A Canada Day cannabis event in Vancouver was raided by police. Cannabis enthusiasts, event goers, and vendors were harassed, assaulted, and arrested by police for attending an event yesterday that has been a tradition in the city for 20 years. What officer? This is wrong, dude. This is wrong. It's hard. You guys know this wrong, man. You guys know this fucking wrong, dude. Come on. Come on, man. Stay back. Only a week after Vancouver City Council regulated medical pot shops, which legalizes the dispensaries while imposing harsh rules, police raided the Cannabis Day event at the Vancouver Art Gallery. City officials say they told the event's organizers to obtain the proper permits, but the group didn't obey. According to NPA councillor George Affleck, the decision was made because the event requires publicly paid police and medics. However, this is an odd excuse considering the resources that went into assaulting and arresting event goers, not to mention the medical aid likely required after people were pepper sprayed and pushed around. Let them go! Let them go! Let them go! Let them go! Holy shit! I've never seen anything like this. Things are getting really intense here, guys. They're fighting, they're pepper spraying them now. Protesters are getting pepper sprayed. No crime! We are the victims! Oh. We are the victims! We came in peace! By yesterday afternoon, police arrested four people, including Bert Easterbrook who was given a police award for heroism during the Stanley Cup riot. In that instance, Easterbrook stopped rioters from burning a truck, so they beat him up. Now he's being punished by law enforcement for attending a peaceful Canada Day event. 